like a blonde My Little Pony. And for me, that's a good feeling, just to clarify. Today I have a new hair tutorial for you guys. It's for this look. It is a big braided bun. Big thank you to Garnier for partnering up with me again for this video. I am super into this bun. I could totally see you dressing it up for a evening wedding or a something that you do when you're dressed up. For some reason my brain is not thinking of one of those things. But you could also totally dress it down like I have today, adding a little handband. This is what I'm into right now. I really hope you guys enjoy it and if you try this look and you post a photo online definitely use hashtag Leanne says because I'd love to see it let's get into it <laughs> what was that all right to start out I'm gonna make sure all my hair is pretty much brushed out and tangle free I washed my hair mm, about a couple days ago so it's been through some things so brushing it out is a really good idea especially because we're gonna be working with some braids <laughs> Next up, I'm gonna grab a section from the front of my head, and I'm grabbing the Fructis Deconstructed Texture Tease Spray, popping the cap off, and just adding a little bit, then going in with my teasing comb and giving it a little tease because I want to have some volume up here. The next step is to create a high ponytail. I'm gonna be cheating just a little bit because I need to add thickness to my hair because my hair is quite thin at the ends. There's been some damage. I don't wanna talk about it. It makes me very sad. So I'm gonna be adding a couple of pieces of extension to my ponytail. If you have thick, gorgeous, amazing hair, I'm sure you do. You don't need extensions at all, but I need a little help. So I'm gonna be, whoa. So I'm gonna be adding these two little sections to my ponytail. It's little baby. Your ponytail doesn't need to be perfect at all and I intentionally like to keep mine, you know, a little bit loose so I can keep some of that volume up here in the top where I teased it. All right, and you can even go in and kind of loosen it up just a little bit if you have a rat tail teasing comb like I do. Actually, you can use just about anything. I mean, you could grab like a long eyeliner and use that, a makeup brush, a chopstick, whatever you've got laying around. If you follow me on Snapchat, you know this is not what my actual ponytail looks like. It is just like the little ponytail that could, except it totally doesn't. It is so tiny. I mean, I kind of love it, but this, I love it a little bit more, not gonna lie. I feel like a blonde My Little Pony, and for me, that's a good feeling, just to clarify. Next up, we're gonna be splitting our ponytail into sections. Totally depends on how thick your hair is or really what works for you. You can split your ponytail into two or three sections. For me, three works great. I'm gonna braid each section and tie it off with a clear elastic. You can use pretty much whatever you want because it's gonna be hidden anyway. Here's my first section, and you could be fancy and do some other kind of braid, but I'm just gonna do a pretty basic three-part braid. And I mean, we all know how to do that. You don't need to make it over complicated, but you could if you want. I mean, whatever, live your life. Do you see my very fashionable band-aid? <laughs> I tried to make it coordinate with my outfit. <laughs> Is it working? We got one braid down, two more to go. Oh, wait a minute. Should I just stop here? Two braids done. Also, it's totally okay if all your braids aren't the exact same size. It's actually kind of cool to have some of them bigger than others. You'll see why. Totally okay. I'm just gonna wrap it in. It's gonna be hidden from the world. The world will never know except for you, so don't don't tell the world. The next step is to just go through and loosen up my braids and make them a little bit bigger and fuller and a little bit more messy. Next up, I'm grabbing the Fructis Sheer Set Breathable Hold Hairspray, and I'm just gonna be using a little bit on my braids and just to kind of like smooth out some of those real wild hairs. We want it messy, but not crazy, all right? 
And now it's time to create the bun. Finally, I've got a bunch of bobby pins on hand. I'm gonna grab one of the braids and just start twisting around the ponytail to begin creating the bun and secure it with a bobby pin. All right, so I am wrapping around and tucking the little tail underneath the braid that's already there. And you can kind of play with the braid once it lays down to make it sit the way that you want. And now I just have one more braid and I'm bringing it around the opposite direction and again, tucking in the tail underneath in the back. All right, so now we've got a bun shape and you can basically just like pull this and mold this into whatever kind of shape you want. It's kind of weird, but it's totally moldable and you can add pins wherever you feel like you need them. You really don't need a ton of pins because braids generally hold themselves together. It's pretty nice. Again, I'm grabbing this sheer set hairspray and I am just gonna blast that all around to kind of like manage any crazy flyaways and also just kind of like lay down any wild hairs up there. And now to finish off my look, I'm gonna be using a headband. You, you can use whatever kind of hair accessory you want or you don't even have to wear one, but I think this is a really cute addition to the bun. This headband has a wire in it, so it allows for a lot of cute little styling. I feel like it looks like little bunny ears or something, cat ears. I like to keep that volume in the front, so I'll just kind of like push that forward. And I like to pull down a few little hairs around my face just to make it look a little bit more relaxed. And we're done. I really hope you guys enjoyed this hair tutorial. Definitely subscribe if you wanna keep up with all my new videos. And if you have subscribed, thank you so much. You are my people and I love you. And if you wanna find me anywhere on social media, definitely come find me. I'm on Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. It's Leanne Says absolutely everywhere and I love hearing from you guys. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone. Poor girl. I think she's been partying too hard. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, my hair is so tangly. Break up those waves. Oh, uh, there's like a piece of plastic in my hair. Really? Really, this is my life. <laughs> Amazing. So like, don't have actual garbage in your hair, but like make it look kind of wild, you know? Yeah, we definitely don't want like perfecty perfect kind of curls. All right, and the next side.